Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for the week of March 22nd through the 28th. Okay, but keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and this could resonate at any time, and the reading may or may not be for you. So what do we have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Basically, for the end of March, what do we have for Taurus? Oh, I got a few. We're going to take them. We've been getting this one a lot opportunities are waiting for you a door so right now it looks like there's a door that is closed you may need to open it horse short journey oh wonderful finger wait warning you of a problem either now or in the near future june something to do with the month of june could have to do with last June, may have to do with the next June, or any time, you know, the month of June is prominent. Could be dealing with somebody that's born in June. Um, but this is, we got an angel here. This thing, things are blossoming. Something, I feel like something is going to blossom in June. Nah, unsuccessful plans. So we have some unsuccessful plans here. There's an opportunity that is waiting for you. You need to take a journey. Uh, there is a problem. It could be coming in June. Something is happening. Huh. Well, there's something that is going to be unsuccessful. There's an opportunity that you have been missing because you've gotten this a couple times. So you, there's an opportunity that you have been missing, missing and, and you're gonna have to find it. Hmm. So what do we have for Taurus? There's some sort of unsuccessful plans here. There's going to be a problem in the near future. You may have to travel to fix it. Maybe you have to travel in June because, you know, something, you may, and I'm not sure what it is. Five of Cups. Five of Cups is grieving over a loss, prolonged grief, sadness, mourning. It's mourning a loss. Not realizing that there's another opportunity, but there is another opportunity. Four of Pentacles reversed. Now this is opening up. It's time to relax. It's letting go of something. You need to let go of something. It may be hard to let go of it. is this we got the tower now the tower is a faded event there is going to be a loss okay and, and I hate to say that I do because the four of pentacles reverse is letting something go you're gonna have to let something go I'm not sure if it has to do with a home a foundation that is not stable it's not strong There could be an internal disruption as well with that tower card. You know, the tower is a faded event, okay, that is brought on by the universe that forces somebody to start with a clean slate. So this is a necessary evil. It is a necessary evil. This is this is meant to happen because you got to let go of something that isn't secure because the four of pentacles upright is security. This isn't secure. The tower isn't secure either. This isn't secure. This is going to be a shock. It's going to it's going to come in uh suddenly. Okay? This is a sudden change. You may be letting go of something that is financially stable. 
okay? Um, there's going to be some sort of major disruption that probably uh, it hurts with the Five of Cups. I mean, I hate to give you this message, but, you know, I'm a Taurus too. So, I mean, this is not what I want to hear, but if it's meant to happen, it's meant to happen. You know? The Five of Cups is grieving over a loss, and the Tower is a loss. Okay? So this is a major life change. Something is being let go. It's a partnership of some sort. Two of Cups reversed. It has to do with a partnership. I was going to say, what does this have to do with? It has to do with a union or a partnership that's not compatible. It's not meant to be. There's no togetherness. There's no unity. There's a lack of equality. There's probably a lack of respect. There could be a massive fight with the tower card or some, you know, or somebody is, well, they're leaving. We have a journey here. Somebody's leaving. There could be another opportunity. This could happen very suddenly. Fives are about change, okay? So there is going to be a massive change and you don't see it coming. And this is grieving the loss of somebody that you have partnered up with, okay? At some point, could be a friend, could be a lover, could be a family member, you know, but th there is a sudden change, okay? Knight of Swords, but there is some sort of help that will arrive. Okay, help is arriving. This is this, you know, you're gonna survive. You will survive. Okay, that is surviving. You know, you're not you're not gonna die over this. All right. Um, but there's definitely sudden change with the tower and the knight of swords. That is things happening very, very fast all of a sudden. There could be a sudden arrival. There could be a sudden departure. Okay. Somebody may be deciding to travel in a new direction. Maybe somebody has run into somebody out of the blue, you know, and that changes everything. There is there is somebody that is going that is going to arrive that is going to help you. Okay, you're going to survive. So you're going to experience an event. And I don't know if it's this week or if it's in June, but we're talking about this week, right? In June, what the hell is this? In June, what is this June? We're going to have to, we're going to have to clarify that. Anyhow, um, Knight of Swords. Now that is definitely, um, it looks like we have somebody that is coming in to save you or protect you or something like that in the nick of time. There could also be an argument here that where things end badly. Somebody may have gotten themselves into a sticky situation, you know, and, and now they have... Uh, I don't know, you got this person down here in the pit, you know, down here. It's like this person, it's it's probably too late for this person. I'm just being honest. I think, I think that uh, this change has to do with a partnership. And somebody... It's too late. It's too late. You know, it's too late. Something like that. It's too late. It's no, it's too late, and now somebody is is coming in to save you or to protect you. You're gonna survive whatever this is. You're gonna have to let go of something that you probably don't want to let go of. Ace of Wands. Now this is an exciting new opportunity. This is uh, a fresh start, and this is a fresh start as well. So, uh, you have a new beginning here. You're going to be going in a new direction, okay? Um, I 
And this is like climbing the ladder. You are going to be climbing the ladder. Everything happens for a reason. This week, I mean, or somebody else is climbing the ladder. I'm not sure if you're dealing with, you know, I don't know. I hope nobody's passing away. I mean, I don't know if that's the case, but I got to say it because I feel like, I mean, I hope that's not the case. Anyhow, Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is an exciting new beginning. It's a new spark. It's a sudden desire. Somebody may, it, it, and we have, we have sudden, 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 sudden. Something is going to happen suddenly. And this is letting go. Letting go. We have somebody here that is letting go. And they're letting go of something they were holding on to. It's a very sudden change. Somebody has been holding on to a false sense of security or a false foundation. It's about to, things may blow up. It could be a sudden uproar, a sudden argument. You know, something happens suddenly between a, a partner that you're dealing with. And when I say partner, don't, you know, don't have a one track mind and think it's, you know, your, it could be your boyfriend. It could be your wife. You know, it could be your friend. It could be anybody. It's somebody that you have some sort of, uh, relationship with. There's going to be a separation. Put it that way. We are going to have a separation and think, and for whoever the person is that you are separating from, it's over. It's too late. There's no going back. It's done. It's, it's, it's done. Okay. There's no choice but to start over. There's no choice but to relocate or something like that or to uh, move on. All right. I'm sorry. But this is in, in turn, this is an, this is a fresh start. Okay. Ace of Swords. Look at the lightning. We have lightning here and lightning here. There is, there is going to be some sort of shock. Okay. This is a shock. This is a shock. This is a shock. Get prepared to be shocked. Maybe you're going to be shocked by some news or some information or something like that. You're probably going to be, this is a wake up call. This is truly a wake up call that comes out of nowhere. Aces are new beginnings. We have two aces here. So this does lead to a new beginning. There is a false sense of security that somebody has been holding on to that is all about to crumble. Okay, things are about to crumble. There could be, I don't know if there's an explosion or a storm or something like that. But I do believe that things are going to change really, really, really fast. Um, some sort of truth or is coming out. Uh, that's the ace of truth. Taking a new approach. Somebody is taking a new approach. They got this sudden desire, maybe to be honest, okay? Or maybe to just uh, let go of something that is not emotionally fulfilling because I don't see any emotional fulfillment here. I see prolonged grief. I see prolonged grief. I see sadness. I see a partnership that is, has been on shaky ground and it hasn't been stable. And there probably has been some sort of holding on for security reasons. You know, sometimes we hold on to a partnership because we're insecure with ourselves and with that four of pentacles and you know we don't want to be alone it's false we're not happy there's a lack of lack of growth here and there's an in the universe which is the tower card which is right in the middle of this reading wants you to uh, be honest it wants you to be your true self it wants you to have um passion right it wants you to have growth it wants you to be excited it wants you to um, live your best life. So anyway, I, somebody is holding on to a false sense of security and things are about to get lit up. Okay. Um, somebody is coming to save the day as well. <clears throat> okay. We have somebody here that has been waiting. This person has been waiting for an arrival that it's going to happen. It is going to happen. So, you know, this could be, we have somebody here that has been grieving over a lost partnership and they've been waiting for their hero. Well, 
that could happen. This could be a new sexual partner. This is a new exciting opportunity to start to build a new foundation, okay? So for some of you, that's the case. This is somebody arriving that is coming to rescue you, okay? Um, this could also be a departure. This could be a partnership where somebody is leaving because, <clears throat> you know, they, they see something better, you know? Um, whatever is happening, there is going to be a sudden change and it's going, it may shock you. It may surprise you. This is quite a surprise. Okay. It is definitely a surprise. Um, You may have thought you were going to be in this situation forever or you were going to die in this situation. I mean, but you're not. You're not. There is somebody coming in. This person is a hero. I mean, this is a warrior. Could be somebody that's been in the military, you know, a soldier or somebody like that. You know, somebody that is... <coughs> Battle ready and has no fear. It could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I do believe that you are going to be starting from scratch and rebuilding or building a new foundation. this June what is June all about Knight of Pentacles reverse you could be dealing with somebody that is unstable unfaithful oh god what is this Knight of Pentacles reverse irresponsible unfaithful jealous lazy not qualified, obsessed, warning you of a problem in the future. There is some, you, you know, you may have somebody that's coming in this week or they've come in recently. They came in out of nowhere, you know, and you may find out and this and things, you know, you, you may be starting, you may be building a foundation or something like that, but I think that you need to look deeper. <laughs> Because it says warning you of a problem now or in the near future. In June is what? Three months away? Wait, wait, wait here. Yeah. Knight of Pen This person may have jealousy issues. Or they may be unfaithful. Or they don't, they're not stable. They're insecure. Unsuccessful plans right after it. We have somebody here that doesn't really follow through. They may lack integrity. Opportunities are waiting for you. Remember I said this door is closed. You might need to close a door. So anyway, I do think that this week you are, you, I, feel, I, feel, I feel like you're starting something with somebody new. But it may not end up successful. And I hate to say that we have death on the bottoms. Endings lead to new beginnings. This is a separation. So I'm not sure what is going on here. This could be, we could go all day with these cards. They, we definitely have an ending here. Something is going to change really fast. And I'm not sure if somebody's not going to make it. You know, I'm not sure if you you could be dealing with an actual... I don't know if somebody's going to pass away or what. And that causes major disruption in your life. Um, but you are probably going to receive some sort of information or communication that surprises you. You know, and, and, and death doesn't have to be a physical death. It doesn't. It can be the death of a situation. You are going to be receiving some surprising information that changes your perspective about something. Okay, um, you definitely have a new beginning here, um, but you may be dealing with somebody who's not really financially stable. They may say that they're financially stable, but they're not. So I do need to let you be aware of that. Um, 
this person could also be, have jealousy issues. Um, I do think that you have somebody that is coming in to 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 save you. You know, they may this may be somebody that is false. Okay, you got to be careful. This person's coming in to save you, and they may not be as secure and real and stable as you think they are. Okay, so I think that you need to be really really careful with who you you know. Uh, having a beginning with somebody is coming in and I think that you need to be careful um, there could also be an ex here and it could be the this person's ex or I don't know if it's one of your exes you know with the knight of pentacles reverse that causes you problems okay um, somebody could be headed towards their ex and I hate to say that I really do but it is what it is right anyway Taurus I feel like this week is a big week of change for you and it's major change this is a profound life change and it's going to happen fast. Okay? Let's see if we got somebody down there that is... It's too late. Okay? That person is... Gone. Okay? And here comes somebody to... You know, rescue. Somebody is coming to the rescue. They may see your vulnerability. They may take advantage of that. Anyhow, I think that you're going to need to... Uh, well, I think that you're probably going to let them rescue you. But I don't think that it's going to last. And I'm sorry. Good luck.